The details around livestock mutilations are as grisly as they are strange. Occurring without warning, under the open sky, animals are being discovered having been victims of laser precision, surgical procedures. Often they are found with their eyes plucked out or organs removed. Sometimes they are completely skinned or have had private parts removed. On occasion they have been found to have a perfect circle or cylinder shape right through them. All of this done while the blood has been drained and not one single drop left at the scene, both on the animal or in the surrounding area. There is never a sign of a struggle. The corpses appear as if they have been dropped from the sky. Strange and paranormal animal mutilations have been a phenomenon across the world for many years, baffling all investigators. The bizarre circumstances in which they occur have led many to claim paranormal activity. From aliens to skinwalkers, chupacabras to the occult, and government experimentation to ancient beasts, there have been multiple claims on the cause of these events. Despite being a well-documented phenomenon across the world, a singular cause for these incidents has not been accepted. Remarkably, the deeper one looks into these cases, the more evidence of the paranormal comes to the surface. Welcome to Mysteries Retold. Reports of livestock mutilation without cause have plagued history, and it is a phenomenon that is still widely reported across the world to this day. Scores of reports have been shared particularly from Mexico, US Western and Midwestern states. However, it is not isolated to this area. In recent times, there has been an increase in reports coming from the UK. In the spring of 2023, both farmers and rural residents of Western Wales in the UK began reporting the strange deaths of their livestock. Consistent with other cases, they started to find their sheep spread across the landscape, completely skinned and drained of blood. Bizarrely, not a drop of blood, nor a sign of a struggle was in sight. A local farmer, Mr. Davies, was the first to report to the authorities. His concern was that the procedure had been conducted with such surgical precision, it was hard to imagine that the mutilations were caused from another animal. He is on record saying, there was no actual body left, just the skin. It was so tidy. It was like someone had been there with a knife and skinned them. It was not long before others started coming forward with similar stories in the area. The descriptions of events matched Mr. Davies' interpretation. Across Britain there have been rumoured sightings of large black cats down the years, and legends still persist of their presence. However, the official line is that big cats do not exist in the wilds of Great Britain. Even so, the nature of these mutilations are not consistent with an animal attack. The surgical precision of the mutilation of decapitation do not point to another creature being the cause. As mentioned, there is rarely any blood found at the scene. The corpses are often found fully drained, organs extracted or the body skinned. Some investigators do believe the killings would be in line with how a big cat would hunt. No sign of frenzy either on the ground or around it, stalking silently as well as extracting organs and soft tissue. However, the absence of blood, even on a sheep's white fur, is undeniably strange. Many people do not buy the big cat theory and point to UFOs or alien abduction. At first this sounds outlandish, but when looking at evidence presented, there may be good reason to suggest something strange is at play. In fact, farmers in Shrewsbury said they saw UFOs doing it with their own eyes. In 2010, another bizarre series of incidents occurred surrounding livestock. But this time, farmers specifically claimed their livestock were being attacked by aliens. One evening, the farmers first witnessed strange orange and red orbs in the sky over the local area. The following morning, their sheep were found dead and to have had various procedures conducted. Some had perfectly neat circular holes right through them. Others had their brains or internal organs extracted with surgical precision. Some had their eyes removed while others had their skin carefully stripped off their body and a few were left as mere skeletons. Yet again there was an absence of blood at the scene. A series of farmers from the area said they saw the orbs that night lasering the livestock. Light was being emitted from the orbs directly down onto their sheep. A UFO investigator named Phil Hoyle looked into the incidents. It was found that the sightings occurred over a 50-mile corridor between Shrewsbury in England and Powys across the border into Wales. All but one farm across the corridor reported the strange occurrence and mysterious deaths of their animals when interviewed. The police, and investigators alike, are baffled. These incidents are not isolated to one area, 
one farm or one group of reporters. They are happening both across UK counties and across countries, with incredible similarities between each case. Sometimes the attacks are on a singular animal, and other times many animals are affected. Another alien expert named Carl Nally investigated the death of almost 600 sheep at a farm in Northern Ireland. You guessed it, the same strange conditions of mutilation occurred here too. Carl suggests that it is aliens experimenting on livestock. He even claims that stories have been shared with him of animals being beamed up into crafts. Carl is also on record saying, We have researched and investigated the only farm location in the world where almost 600 animals, over a 20-year period, have been subjected to precise surgical procedures to remove specific body parts. Highly advanced and apparently otherworldly technology has been utilized to perform these clinical procedures. There is a sinister and deeply shocking new aspect to this enigma on the farm, whereby many targeted animals that are subjected to these bizarre procedures are left alive afterwards by the unseen perpetrators. Globally, the animals are almost invariably discovered dead and drained completely of their blood. Further near identical reports in the UK have come from Yorkshire, Cumberland, Northumberland, Wiltshire, Somerset and Lincolnshire to name but a few. Further afield simple research reports many cases in the United States, Mexico, Bolivia, Iceland, Australia again to name but a few. No doubt there are many more cases. It cannot be denied that these incidents are happening. The encounters are extremely well documented. Believers in the theory that it is extraterrestrial activity also point to accounts where livestock start behaving very strangely prior to events. On a hillside in Sussex in the UK, a flock of 300 sheep started lining up in an eerie pattern of circles, one placed within another. They moved in this formation for several hours before reports of mutilations started flooding in over subsequent days. As mentioned, this is a phenomenon around the world, and some simple research leads to countless similar stories. In fact, there are so many stories that in 2011 declassified FBI files from 1970 were released that reported the incidents to the White House. The documents state that extraterrestrials were killing cows. They stated that over 8,000 cows were snatched by mysterious crafts, mutilated, and then dropped from the sky. Long have these stories of mutilations plagued the Americas, with some in Mexico claiming chupacabra activity. The chupacabra is a mythical monster that supposedly lives in parts of Puerto Rico and Mexico, but has been reported in the United States too. It acts like a vampire and drains the blood of livestock. There have been multiple sightings too. In 1995, various villages reported that the creature had been seen attacking goats and sheep. In September 2023, authorities were investigating more suspected chupacabra activity in Tambola, Mexico. Goats and sheep on several farms were decapitated. They had their blood drained, and some even had their heads removed. Other carcasses were intact but had deep bite marks on their neck. Once again, there was a remarkable absence of blood. The chupacabra is a creature of myth, although some claim it was caught on camera in June 2023 in Bolivia, a very similar spate of livestock killings, where all animals had been drained of blood, prompted the area to be investigated by drone. In the drone footage, which is available online, a strange two-legged creature can be seen escaping across fields. In terms of myths, many people believe the chupacabra is real. There are reports of strange animal mutilations right back to the 17th century through to today, with multiple unconfirmed theories. Another such theory involves skinwalkers. In 1996, Terry Sherman had bought a 512-acre property. Shortly afterwards, mutilations of animals occurred, again consistent with other cases from across the world. Sherman claims he saw a wolf-like creature that was three times the size of a normal wolf and was impervious to rifle shots. A researcher at the time also claims to have seen a strange humanoid creature with beaming yellow eyes, stalking and spying on him from a tree. Other cases have happened on the property since. This 512-acre ranch is where the incredible mystery of Skinwalker Ranch began, which we will report in more detail in future videos. Skinwalkers originate from the Navajo culture and are essentially a witch-type entity who can morph into, possess or turn themselves into an animal. Some legends state they use this form to mutilate other animals, ultimately extracting what they need for spells and witchcraft. With such a wealth of sightings, evidence and theory, we ask ourselves what the cause of these strange mutilations both in the UK and across the world is. Broadly speaking, there are two camps, 
those that believe these are ordinary killings, and those that believe something paranormal is occurring. One thing is for sure, the farmers involved, across the world all state that they have never seen anything like it. Some incidences carry evidence of linked UFO activity or alien abduction. As much as that sounds like a sci-fi film, there are thousands of witnesses across the world that claim to have seen strange lights in the sky before livestock mutilation. Others claim the attacks are carried out by paranormal entities such as skinwalkers. A small section of folk believe the events have ties with ancient satanic cults across the globe. Then of course there are others who think livestock are being attacked by mythical beasts, such as the chupacabra or legendary large black cats. The idea that large black cats could be the culprits in the UK isn't overly outlandish. They once did roam in the wild, and there are still rare rumours from some that they have been spotted. A lynx was shot by a farmer as recently as 1991. However, the official line is they do not exist in the wild anymore. But even if it was a large wild cat, it's very doubtful that they extract body parts without leaving any evidence, not even a drop of blood. Then what about the surgical precision, or large perfect holes punctured through the corpses, or sightings of strange lights in the sky seemingly linked with the events? With such mysteries there is a huge amount of speculation and individual theory. The facts, however, are simple. It is a mystery where strikingly similar stories are reported across the globe, they often have no confirmed conclusion, and they baffle authorities and investigators alike. These accounts are not isolated to one or two stories, there are thousands, and it is very much a real phenomenon. So much so that organizations such as the FBI have also been involved and actively investigating. What do you think is behind the spate of livestock mutilation both across Britain and the rest of the world? Could it really be something paranormal? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. We are always interested in hearing your theories and ideas. If you have enjoyed our content today, please do like the video and subscribe to the channel. It really does help us continue to develop and bring you the very strangest mysteries from around the world. Until next time, folks, sleep tight and remember the world is littered in mystery. Perhaps all isn't as it really seems. Good night.